Wow, the haters are live on YouTube. I just wanna free my titties, they just wanna be free. Hey guys, this is Moonbear. <laughs> this is so weird to me, like to sit in front of a camera, even though I've done it like a couple times, you know? Because, you know, modeling and stuff. <laughs> so anyway, today's video is about like, the frequently asked questions about nipple stickers. I don't know if you've um, found this video just by searching or if you found it through my Instagram. If you found it through Instagram, you know, like, I'm the nipple sticker queen. And so, like, I know a lot about nipple stickers. And I'm here to share answers to some questions that you probably have had and haven't had answered by me yet. And yeah, so I'm gonna like crunch through that right now. Um, <laughs> this is still like, this is weird. So I'm gonna have to like read my notes and stuff, but like I'll get better at this if I keep doing it, which I think I will. Anyway, so the first question I'm gonna address is what are nipple stickers? I can just take it and show you. This is a nipple sticker. I don't know if the zoom is good. I don't know. We got it. Uh, uh, autofocus. Anyway, and this one is used, so it's not sticky anymore. Uh, what do you, they made from different materials and fabrics and like sequin and like there's even like tassels that you've seen, probably burlesque performers wearing. Yeah. So that's what they are. Nipple stickers are uh, nipple covers with a sticky back so you can stick it on your boob. That's it. I wear nipple stickers and it's, you know, it's so funny. I got shade on Facebook the other day. Like, like first, uh, if you're gonna come at me, like, let me be able to respond. Like if you send me a message and I'm like blocked, I don't think I have her blocked, maybe. But like, why even send the message? Like, do you think it's gonna hurt me? It's, it's not. Like, so anyway, to answer the question, um, you can wear nipple, I, I wear nipple stickers because like, it's like very freeing. Like I don't have to, I don't even wear bras either, but we'll get to that in another video I'm thinking. Yeah, so wearing nipple stickers is like a very freeing experience. Like, I don't know, you have to do it. Like if you're a woman, cause like men, they like do it all the time, like no problem, no big deal, because that's how it is. But anyway, yeah, I wear it for me, and I feel good, and like it's it's not for anyone else. So if you're watching the girl who sent me that Facebook message, that's your answer. Next one is how long can you wear nipple stickers? Um, you can wear them for a while, but the more you wear them the the more it's gonna i guess hurt when it, you take it off but i've worn nipple stickers maybe like <laughs> the longest is probably more than um 24 hours like i was turned i was lit ooh, ooh, partying and um i didn't take them off <laughs> i went to sleep woke up probably went and did some skating or something and had them on like for another 12 hours or yeah, I don't know how many hours, but yeah. So you can wear nipple stickers for a long time. Well, the ones I have, what are these? These, like I have a like a collage of nipple stickers. Anyway, the ones by Nippies, that's the ones I wear a lot. Um, They last for hours. Do they hurt when you take them off? I'm gonna say yes and no because it like it like I said it depends on how long you wear them so like if you wear them for like two or three hours it's not gonna hurt when you take it off if you wear it for like how I did like 24 hours or so you, you're gonna get a little sting when you're <laughs> peeling it off oh. But it's not crazy. It's not like, oh my god, I need to go to the hospital and go get my boob like reattached. It's not like that. You know, it's just going to sting a bit. And you know, that's it. You got to just either like take it off. Oh, 
that goes to the next another question so let me stop there can you get arrested for wearing nipple stickers um in new york city or as new york state as a whole you cannot or you should not get arrested as a woman for like wearing nipple stickers with no shirt on or like yeah just having even being topless no nipple sticker no nothing no shirt in new york city you're not going to get arrested for that um other states i have to learn about but i think i've seen a video or two somewhere where it's like at least 32 states it's like illegal for women to be like topless like bare chested and i think they get arrested for that i think that's a thing in california like the only way they can be topless is if they wear um nipple stickers i'll have to look into that i'll make a video about that later can you reuse nipple stickers i haven't tried to reuse nipple stickers um but there's a pizza one somewhere where is it there's a pizza nipple sticker that i like got to stick back on the like whatever you want to call the thingy when you have a sticker or something and you put it back on i put it back on there and i want to try to wear it again so that will be another video i'm still looking for it it's like hidden i don't even know where the other pizza is look the pizza is like back on it's whatever this is i don't know and i wore this two years ago and that's going to be interesting to try to wear it two years later and see if it actually sticks or if I'm just going to be out here and it doesn't, well, I guess it matters to me, but legally I'll be okay. But uh, you know, when were nipple stickers created? Okay. So it's, it's not that much to look back on. Like I've dabbled. I tried to look it up for this because you know I'm supposed to know uh, but it, it seems that it started in the 19th century and it's not really much to go off from that but yeah so it started around then and then to lead to the next question who wore them first I believe it was like burlesque performers wore them with their costumes first they were the first ones to wear um, nipple stickers they were um, nipple tassels yeah um, and I believe uh, since I don't know I need to do more research but anyone who is like a sort of um, like women that were sort of uh, performers for men I think they were also in a part of that uh, period of wearing the nipple stickers first so yeah that I need to look into that more I guess but yeah that's just like a brief where can you buy nipple stickers okay so <laughs> you can I know here in New York City there's actually I want to say Ricky's you can get it from Ricky's New York City and I'm guessing they have an online store because we're in the future so you can purchase it from there and then yeah, like you have to look online and I'll do another video on like all the sites that I know that have like top quality nipple stickers because you can go on Etsy and like eBay and find nipple stickers, but um, I'm not trying to buy it from there. So you shouldn't either. Yeah, we don't do that. <laughs> Why do I call pasties nipple stickers? So that started when I first started wearing nipple stickers. My friend Nina Mo, pictures somewhere. Uh, her picture's gonna pop up, I don't know, in her Instagram. Uh, yeah, she like said it. And I was like, oh yeah, nipple stickers, that's funny. That's like a funny way to call them. And I stopped calling them pasties and I started calling them nipple stickers. So yeah, like, I don't know. It, it just, it sounds more fun than like pasties nipple stickers people are like what nipple once they hear nipple they're like ooh I don't know it's like it's more like I don't know you know what I'm saying like would you are which which one do you prefer saying nipple stickers or pasties like yeah let me know in the comments below I guess what is the best way 
to take them off, which ties into an earlier question. So the best way to um, take nipple stickers off would be, uh, you know, okay, so if you wore them for a few hours, you just peel them off and no big deal. It's not going to hurt. But if you wore them for like, you know, more than a few hours and you've been out there and hopefully, or I mean, hopefully it, to make it easier, you were sweating. So like, it'll just, you know, rip off without being um, like painful. But if you weren't sweating or the sweat didn't affect it, like Nippy says that they're sweat proof and waterproof. Um... <laughs> Get ready to treat it like a band-aid. Like that's the best way. You're just gonna have to rip it off. And you know, you have to deal with pain for a few seconds, but I mean, I think you should be able to deal with that. I don't know if you had a baby yet. I haven't, I'm, I'm not going there. But yeah, uh, you should be good after that. <laughs> I think that's it, I'm pretty sure. Um, Thank you for watching. I'm sorry, I keep looking here and I'm supposed to look here. It's it's new for me, it's really new. Thanks for watching this video. If you got this far, I'll have more um, videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays, hopefully, if I keep up. <laughs> and you, if also, also if you're a reader, um, I'll be updating my website, like the subscription, wait, what am I saying? The transcribed version of the videos will be on my website every Tuesday and Thursday as well. So if you want to read, go to freemyboobs.com. It'll be somewhere down here. Or if you want the videos, they'll be on YouTube and like on the site. So either way, you should subscribe to the um, website or if you want, subscribe to my channel like this this YouTube channel I don't know where I'm pointing to but yeah and for those who prefer social media updates you can follow me in the links in the description below or I'll put like icons somewhere in my head I don't know if I'm good at the editing yet but yeah follow the links below Liddy titty out